Okay, so I have my Samsung Galaxy S7 here, and over here I have my Samsung Galaxy S6. And I'm gonna show you how to transfer all of your content from your old Galaxy phone, doesn't matter if it's a S6 or S5, S4, S3, even all the Notes, even all the uh, Galaxy S series, all the J series, directly to your new S7 or S7 Edge. Now out of your box, out of your S7 or S7 Edge, you, it should've came with this USB connector. And let me show you how easy this is. Okay, we're going to be able to transfer everything, including like your apps, and you get to pick what apps you want to transfer. Your email is going to transfer over, all the passwords, all your settings, your bookmarks. And I'm going to show you all that, your photos, your videos. So at the other end of the USB, you want to plug into your uh, USB connector here. And I'm going to plug this into your my S6 here, your older uh, Galaxy phone. Okay. And right here I get a uh, smart switch pop-up. Choose an app to use for the USB. I'm just going to click on the smart switch. And of course this is a pop-up. You can go into your settings and uh, to retrieve it. So right away it says welcome, uh, old device, new device. And I'm going to go ahead and click on start here. I'm going to agree to this. Other device is locked. Okay, let me go ahead and unlock it. There we go. Let this like run up. And the other cool thing is too, you can actually, um, if you have an iOS, you're able to transfer that onto your S7 as well. So give us a second here. Another cool thing I want to mention too is take a look at this. If you look on here, you can see that my battery is charging on my S6. It's actually charging for my S7, it's charging my S6. And that happens to all the other, my other Galaxy phones as well. And it doesn't matter if I switch the USB connector to my older phone, it's still gonna be the same. Your S7 is gonna be charging your older uh, Galaxy phone. Okay, so let me go ahead and go in here and we can see that I have a total estimated time to transfer everything is about 29 minutes, almost 30 minutes. And my estimated total size is two, about 2.3 gigs. Okay, now I can transfer my contacts. Um, these are grayed out because I don't have it on this phone. Your call logs, your internet settings, like your bookmarks, your history, all your emails can be transferred, your apps here, your settings, Wi-Fi password, all that. Uh, your messages, your photos, your music videos, documents, and under settings here. Now take a look at this. I'm going to go ahead and uh, click on this gear icon here. And then from here you can pick and choose uh, which actual apps you want it to transfer uh, onto your S7, okay? So let me just go back here for a second. And you can see that the estimated total size is two, like almost 2.3 gigs. However, if I uncheck like my videos here, you can see it go down from 2.3 gigs to 830 megs. And it shows you the size on, on the side here as well. So I'm gonna go ahead and just go ahead and transfer everything, okay? Just like this, and it's gonna take about 30 minutes. I'm gonna click on transfer. And from here, I'm gonna go ahead and fast forward so you can see what the screen looks like, okay? Okay, well, there we go. It is all done now. All of my contacts are transferred. All my many, many emails I have transferred. All the passwords are linked in. Uh, my browser, you can see all my apps that I chose. They're all on here, all my games, everything is on here. So that's pretty much it. If you guys have questions or anything, just comment below. If you guys subscribe, share, like. I appreciate it, thanks, bye.